hilarious to me. Like, I, I think they only, okay. I think they put him on 20 just to piss him off. Because there's no way he went to enough tournaments to make 20. There's no, he liked to, like, six if he, gets, if he actually gets ranked this time again, not, I'm going to be really It's not going to happen. Yeah, it, it happened last time, man. He's somehow two he made, locals or something, dude. Yeah, somehow he made it, man. I was surprised. Who, who cares about getting ranked? Like, when you're, when you're like, when you're Zen, you, you, you're PR. Like, you're basically, like, PR even when you're not PR. You're ghost PR. It's like time. Yeah. You're ghost you're PR. You're ghost PR? Yeah, like, you're pretty much PR. Like, you're going to get seated as if you're PR at our locals. Even if you're not on the ranking because you didn't attend. Unless you're, like, losing all the time. But, no, he's just mm. not attending. Anyway, let's commentate the actual match. Getting into the match, we have Shine versus Jump Steady on PS2. I'm uh, sorry, Jump Steady, to, just to correct myself here. Jump Steady is ranked 17th, and then Shine ranked 19th. And Shine taking that first stock with that jab lock into down smash. Got him with that down throw back here. I believe he, no, I believe now he has no jump. Right. right, it's going for these empty hops, trying to mix his timing here on the grab. And very smart of Shine sticking to Squirtle, not only for the combos, but for the like the neutral game Squirtle has is definitely like it's pretty up, yeah. Probably the best out of the out of the Pokemon. He has good speed, low profile, really hard to hit. Forward air. Yeah, <laughs> forward air. Literally did he forward air. Biggest thing that Squirtle does, does suffer is being like top three lightest character in the right. game. Light, uh not the best kill power. No. Edge guarding is not that great like, either. Not, not the best, but it's it's there. He has his water gun for edge guarding, but like I that's barely anything. That's like one move. <laughs> and that's like telling me Mario has his flood for edge guarding. Like Mario is not gonna only go for flood, man. That's because Mario has everything else. <laughs> exactly. That's why you switch to everything else. Like, I have a sword and try sword. Jump steady. Tried to weaken the shield with the Oh, oh no. Classic the wrong Shine. Yep. Anyway, uh, jump steady. I like the way he tries to weaken your shield, and then he goes for an air to try to get a shield poke, maybe. And jump steady really lo He loves that move. Yeah. I don't blame him. Take him on the round. Nobody about. blames him. Because everyone loves that move. Everyone who plays Palu loves that move, at least. It's a great I like. I actually, I actually love back air. Anyways, back to the from Ivasaur. Put him off the stage. Sets up the leaf shield. I'm sorry, the... The Razor Leaf only so can kind of force the recovery to go a little bit lower. That was the most pointless teleport cancel I've ever seen in my life. He, like, teleport cancel, then he jumped back to the position he was already in. Yo, man, man had time for it, though. Give him some respect. That was really All right, how is Sheena going to get He was trying to impress stage? you, man. Come on. Give him some credit. <laughs> I got parry. Tries to, after the parry, uh, Sheena tried to ease off and go back and take the stage. Oh, I was going to say, he has to directional air dodge away because he does not want to get caught by Palutena. Right, nice, jump. using all those jumps. He just kind of lands into him with there. Jump steady ends up getting hit by it. Really awkward reversal to get hit by. Because, like, you you see it coming. Like, it's it, it, here it comes. Here, Oh, I got hit by it. <laughs> Ooh, don't, dude, I feel like... Oh, Shine had the read in the beginning. Went for a dash grab to try to, like, like make up for missing the read. Jump steady just jumps over it and back there. Dash grab is very laggy in this game. Have enough time to just punish them when you jump over them. That's going to cost Shine his second nice. stock. Guys in on the down throw. I feel like uh, Ivysaur's F throw is it's reactable, so you can start off by dying away. Wow, just caught him with that uh, drop off the platform back air, evening up the game. And Squirtle, that's uh, it's just a scary position. Like they take your stock switch to Squirtle. All right, I'm at zero. Squirtle's on the screen. Um, let me just not get hit at all. <laughs> yeah, and I feel like that's what Jim Study's trying to do is not get hit at all, right? He's using a lot of these jumps. He's staying on the platforms. He's trying to move around Squirtle with respect to the fact that, okay, if I get caught in the combo, literally Sheena gets to make up his percent. Nice. Reads the landing here with an up air. Jumps in. He takes the sky. He's trying to finish it off early. He knows Squirtle's weight there could be the demise, especially with an up air that high. Wasting his air dodge. Does Trainer get his air dodge back when he switches? I, I actually I actually don't it. think so, no. Does he not? No? Okay. Back air. Yep. Wow, that just and it has intangibility, so it's able to bypass Ivasaur in air. And oh, yeah, right, was close. And, oh, he ran the directional air dodge in, and he was there for the grab. Is he gonna be able to make this back? Oh my goodness, what a tough position. Able to make it back with Ice Switches to Zard. Oh, he's gonna rob him. Criminal. Criminal. Bam. Man, you better, hope, you better, you better, you better hope Palatina was not gonna press charges on that robbery there, because she did. And unfortunately, the punishment by robbery is guilty. No court of Pierce in the background, unfortunately, man. Able to get that dash attack to secure the stock. Um, contrary to popular belief, not every non um, non zoom in is bad DI. Uh, that may have been, but there's some moves in the oh, game yeah. that straight up just don't have. Like sometimes they'll have percents where they'll, they'll kill with good DI, but they just won't zoom in anyway. Oh, you, oh. Um, Example: Wolf Flash when it spikes uh, off the ground. Critical hit. Critical yeah, hit, the yeah. Criti the zoom in. Uh, yeah, the sorry. Yeah, the critical hit. The critical hit animation. Not the animation, like the effect. 
Yeah, it's... Yeah, I totally forgot it was called Critical Hit, too. I thought it was just Hero, but it's the rest of the cast. How's he going to punish his out of shield? Isn't able to get it. Caught his jump in with that forward air, and I'm actually taking notes right now. <laughs> oh, that's why I used up about using on oh, Never mind. I know nothing. Got him with that forward throw off stage. Tried to get the Nair onto the ledge. Tried to catch his landing with that neutral air, but missed barely. Now it's going to be a free punish to do a lot of damage. Up forward air into back air. Clean combo coming out from Shine. Charge of the water gun too. Back Tried throw. To oh, no. Nope. jump. Able to come back on the stage here. Something I realized compared to Smash 4 in this game, like guessing on ledge is a little bit worse because the ledge options like are just a little bit quicker. And in general, characters are a little bit quicker. So they have more time to punish a guess at ledge. That is true, but I also feel at the same time that like, there are some pretty obvious answers that characters love to go for. Mm -hmm. Like on the ledge, like for example, like Bowser Jr. side B. Of course. Those, those things become really predictable, so you're going to go for the safe bet and punish that, that one. I mean, going for guesses isn't a bad thing as long as you cover your you cover yourself after you, you go for them. Mm -hmm. Unless you go for a hard commitment. Got him with that up, he had a shield, but uh, Speaking of hard commitment it, it kind of just like didn't happen. That's weird. That, that Like we never see that in this game. But that wasn't like, it didn't look random. It was more of like the positioning was awkward. So that's why it didn't connect fully. And I also feel it kind of have to the fact that Squirtle has a low profile. Yeah, and Squirtle, Squirtle's tiny. He's a pest. Squirtle, call pest control. Rolls past him, parried, and then he was like, okay, he recognized multi-hit. I'm going to shield the whole thing, not trying to die here. That thing is absurdly strong. And j wow, he deserves to get up smash there. He deserves that. I'm actually mad he did that. <laughs> <laughs> That's the second attempt, too. Didn't punish his uh, down B onto the ledge. 141% on Shine right now. Isn't able to close it out just yet. Got clipped by the last few hits of that side B, but this isn't quite enough to take the stock. Oh. Jump said he's looking a little bit okay. Yeah. I mean, I guess it worked out, but he was like just throwing out kill moves. <laughs> <laughs> he was already looking for it like, too. Die, please. Nair, nice. And he nearly moves away to definitely sense the fact that Shinea was kind of like, okay, I'm going to go in after Nair. Nice, down tilt. Good forward air, puts him off the stage. 77% of the ZSS. He's probably looking to throw him off stage, switch to Ivy here. Ooh, got him with that down tilt, down <gasps> smash. Uh, yep, then that's gonna work through. No tech. That thing is strong. I believe that was, if I'm not, his down smash and his F smash look scarily similar, but I know his down smash is a little bit quicker. Up smash is the the water, the water, uh, water towers. No, I mean F smash. F -smash oh, F smash. F -smash? F -smash? Yeah, smash, they look. They look Sorry, did I did I say down? Did I say up smash? Excuse me. His F smash and his down smash look very similar. Jump steady right now. Trying to keep him in the air. Using yep. his big hitboxes. Caught his oh. landing. Not enough to take the stock, however. Try to dance. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Anti airs him with that up B. That thing is insane in this game. I was about to say something really bad, but never mind. I'm a horrible influence. Anyway, got him with it, that it happens, man. It happens. Got him the follow ups. Reacting to that air dodge. Woo! Oh, nice. Almost gets the second air, too. That would have been really crucial to go for the. Flip can confirm at the ledge. Went for the Zarin to Nair, but Shine spot dodging, but getting hit by that jab. Jump steady right now, bringing this back. Mm -hmm. Trying to stay in that zone around Charizard, Ooh, but unfortunately in the middle of the Paralyzer, Shine will use that to not only take an inch, but the mile and eventually put a point on the board. Not the best Paralyzer there. Used it at close range. Shine was like, all right, and just jumped over it, back out him. Yeah. Clean, punish the lag on it. Dead as hell, like, you're done. <laughs> This is actually Jump Steady's return to Hat after like a three week hiatus. From Hat at least, not in general. We're <laughs> <laughs> getting into getting into the second third game, excuse me. Jelani sw jump steady switching back to his tried and true Palatina, realizing that Man, that is not tried and true. This man was a born ZSS man and he said Palatina top tier, hold the phone, man. I need yeah, to pay bills. Facts, exactly. I mean zero suits. Amazing in this game as well. But Jump Steady in this game better known for his better known for his palo, as tragic as that sounds. Hey man, sometimes we're just trying to get W's and PRs and win money. It's okay, man. Oh, I feel like he, he, he should have just grabbed him. <laughs> just yep. Jump steady. Oh, that was close. He almost got the landing too. Yeah, he was smart enough to delay his landing just a little bit to get the punish on that. 
I believe that was forward smash. They look the same. <laughs> it's not smashing, it's forward smash. Oh, okay. Yeah. Forward smash is like he throws the water at you, down smash, he spins. That was forward that smash. Was, that was forward smash, yeah. Nice. Ooh, drop down with that explosive flame, getting him off the ledge so he can recover safely. Completely reset, like, not reset, completely, like, flip flip the tide of positioning. Oh, I totally forgot they actually fixed uh, Flare Blitz. Got him with that back air out of shield. Squirrels out of shield options are just on point. Like, they're, they're amazing, and Shine is reacting perfectly with them. Used the extra jump given by Zard to try to mix him up off the switch, but he didn't really get much off of it, and now he's getting neutralized by Palutena. Good forward there. Looking for more back guys. I feel like that's all the jumps that he's looking for in this matchup between him and Ooh. Charizard is to actually get the intangibility. And Called out that full hop with the forward air. That was such a hard call out from, from Shine, excuse me. Went for the double explosive flame, didn't quite get it. Went for an up smash trying to catch his drift onto the ledge. But Shine not biting, recognizing the, F the up smash was charging. Drifted back and recovered safely. Now he's back in neutral and it's basically even if Squirtle touches you. Okay, here we go. I feel like in a situation where Squirtle down tilts you, shielding is like the absolute worst thing to do. Because like a lot of the time he doesn't have a true grab. He's dead. <laughs> he doesn't have a true grab, but people will shield. There's some characters that can jab, but also at the same time, Palu's jab is decently like all the ground options are pretty slow. Yeah. Maybe if he like grabs, maybe he can grab him out of his down tilt attempted dash grab. Back air? No, it goes for forward air. And jump steady right now is just He's in control. Yeah. And that's no what you, jump. That, that's what you said, too. Oh, you want to make sure if you're using Palutena, you have control as much as possible. Jump said he's pressure right now is just on point. Shine reacting to that dash grab. Went for the drop down back air. Ooh, once again, catching his uh, drifting down, drifting downwards after that nair with mm. that back air. Down throw. Nice. Using the raw back air. Oh, nice. he went for auto radical. Nice. I felt that was might have been might have been missing, but I'm sorry. That either either it was or because Shine like reacted to it. it yeah, or at least he did. It seemed. Either he reacted or he expected because it was pretty quick. He either expected it. Um, oh no! If that was robbery, goodness. if I have not my seen goodness. it, that was robbery. My, I had to pick my job off before I fucking jumped it. Where he's all right. At least he's determined. He's still determined. Look at him. He has a smile. He has a half sort of smile on his face. Kind of disappointed. He knows he got robbed. Shine one leg over the other. But it was also his fault too, like trying to go for explosive flame like, at that I mean, point. Of course, of like, yeah. you, you're not just gonna like get robbed and it's not your fault. Like it's gonna pretty much every time like you messed up. <laughs> and Shine sitting leg over leg. That's how he plays, by the way. I've he never just seen, plays so comfortable. I've never seen someone look that relaxed, like ever. Like even like when Zachary was playing crisscross at Genesis, he's still not as relaxed. <laughs> they also have uh, from Japan Rudolph. He has like a really oh yeah yeah, yeah yeah yeah. He like lays down on two chairs on his yep. stomach with his elbows like this. And jump steady right now is he's 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 not playing like he's down two one. <laughs> That's for sure. He's definitely not lost his fire. No, not at all. Caught him with that explosive flame once again, calling out the Razor Leaf. All right, nice punish on the. Nice, going for up air. Bit of a change too, because usually most opponents will actually try to get away from, from down throw, and the jump stick kind of had no DI there, trying to avoid getting hit by Vine Whip. Is he gonna die? Oh, no, that's good. Yeah, that was smart. He used a drift. He used a drift. <laughs> that was like a free two frame if I've ever seen one. But jump said he was like, "Oh, I'm not getting drift right here. I'm good." Down tilt, down nice, tilt yeah. Charizard's, Charizard's actual hitbox is actually pretty big, especially the fact that he puts his head first when he goes for up e. That down tilt is also active for nine frames, so if you do down tilt and miss, you should just like... You'll hit something, man. Probably quit smack. Anyway, uh, <laughs> yeah, jump steady. Uh, again, like I said, not playing like he's down 2-1. He's playing with a lot of fire, very determined. And that's what you kind of need to, especially when you lose games like that. You want to make sure your head is still in the game. I really like Shine's movement on the ground. He uses his like his movement to pressure you into rolling, and he catches it with like drift back forward airs with, with um, Charizard, with Charizard or even uh, mm -hmm. Ivysaur. Ivysaur. Yes, it's true too because Ivysaur does get a lot from going for those drift back forward airs. It's gonna be quite a lot of damage if. All right, caught him with dude. 
Jumps oh, another one? Yep, and there's a third one here, and he puts Squirtle off the stage with so much disadvantage. Sometimes Jump City will just catch you sleeping, and he'll just, like, he'll grab Ledge and immediately jump Nair. <laughs> and he'll, yep. that's a Nair string. Barbare misses the opportunity, but he takes the time to recharge on multiple jumps, and he makes sure he hits one before he gets away. Over the falling up air with Zard. I mean, you said it right. He's not playing like this is game four. This is, he's playing this like it was game five. I'm trying to close it all the way home. Nice. Charizard's about to, it was like wide open. <laughs> he was suffering when he got grabbed there. Yep. Nice. Yep. He waited. He waited. He just stood there. Yeah, that was like textbook. Wow. Wow. Another Wow. Wow. It's Squirtle's weight. Squirtle's oh. weight, man. It's oh, not wow. the greatest. Kind of makes him susceptible to getting hit by that because he's the fast faller. Palu's Nair, it's been like, what, nine months? And it still never ceases to amaze me. Yeah, you're right. It has been nine months. This game came out nine months ago. Remember when we got the trailer? Ooh, and do jump steady right now. It just. Oh, okay. I like that. What a change in pace, too. He like wasn't going to go for a wire bear. He wasn't going like to go for like a forward air or kind of read the switch. If, yeah, wow, he did. He like read the switch, but he dashed a little bit too much forward. Reading the, reading, I'm sorry, reading the switch is on a godlike level because that was something we only saw at Evo between Tweak and, what uh, the hell? and Gluttony. <laughs> that was a very weird teleport. Definitely a misinput there from, Jalan, from Jump City. The, no, okay, good DI coming out from Sheena. DIing behind the explosive flame. He's got to be careful. Oh, goodness. This is a scary position. Yep. Didn't get the punish with the teleport on stage. Went for the dash attack, just dashing past like the wall, like the invisible wall kind of set in neutral where let's see, like I'm not gonna cross this line. They just crossed the line of dash attack. That nair is silly. <laughs> this is a uh, this is prime Charizard percent. What? If you said you, you said joking? it, you said it. This is prime. <laughs> Oh my god, he was shook! He was shook! He doesn't even believe he got it! Are you joking? I th I feel okay, so that back air did look like bad DI, but I think that would have just killed. It would, yeah, it would have killed. It would have killed. It was sweet spot. It was sweet spot. like it would have. Oh, yeah, that was definitely. That, that was sweet spot. Absolutely the sweet spot. That was Mark Tipper's like sweet spot. That was the diabetes spot.